I'm AJ King, I'm 14 years old, and I'll be performing two monologues entitled The Genius by Horace Holly and More Ways Than One by Joseph Arnani. Well, maybe I'm wrong, but whenever I think of the Old Testament, I see a man under a tree. A man who also did all three, you know, and found something real about it. And he sits there, calm and strong, something like a tree himself. And every once in a while, somebody comes along, a boy, you know. The boy sits there and talks to him all about himself, just as we imagine we like to do with our fathers if they weren't so busy, or our teachers if they didn't depend so much upon books, or our ministers if we thought they would really understand. The man doesn't say much, maybe, but the boy goes away much stronger and happier. What I don't understand is how nowadays people seem more grown up and competent than those old men were, in a way. And we do such wonderful things like skyscrapers and aeroplanes, and yet, we aren't as wonderful as they were in the, old, in the Old Testament with their jugs and their wooden plows. I mean, we aren't so big as the things we do. Well, those old fellows were so much bigger. We smile at them. But if one day one of our machines flew over on us, what would we do about it? Mr. Agonon, um, the things that I deal with every day, it seems to always be happening to me. And how do I know when it's big enough for me to get you? I don't want to bother you over every single thing because then I think you'll get angry at me as if it's my fault. And I know, I know, I'm no angel, but I just think it's because of the fact that things started out wrong for me. And ever since then, it's always been a problem. Like you said earlier, perception. People see me as some loser. And over time, that perception has only been cemented in people's minds. Because I've tried. I've tried to show other sides of myself and I've never looked at differently. It's like a curse I can't break. And I guess I sort of accepted the fact that I'm this loser, troublemaker, or whatever you want to call me. I've grown to become this character in people's minds because it makes everyone happy. I bring comfort in a way because I'm labeled. And I know, I know, that sounds crazy, but these are just things I'm dealing with. And I just wanted you to hear it from me. Thank you.